This year we've been kind of, we've made that kind of step, like we've been playing a lot of the main stages, which is great, you know, and it's good to sort of feel like progressing or whatever, but like, yeah, the, the tents are kind of a, a lot more fun in a way. So the horror is great, they play some new songs, it's the, the, the album that's coming out soon, which is brilliant. It's great to see the Rolling Stones, I thought they really pulled it off. Justin had a, had a, like a kick, sort of creative desire I suppose and like creative form and he just like suddenly had these bunch of songs then he was like I, I really want to play these to you and you know Melody Calling really stuck out as um, something that was really exciting for, for all of us I think and and yeah we just found ourselves with um, with some time and like the desire to and, uh, and a couple of amazing producers who seemed to be into the idea of just doing a you know, just doing an interim thing, you know, just just making some music, just not for any particular grand design, no no great purpose, but just, you know, for the desire of being creative. And that's kind of like how we've gone about making music from the start. And I think, you know, it, it was good. It's turned out really well. We're all really happy with it. I think John Hill is an amazing producer. And it's uh, it's really interesting to work with him that you can, you know, it doesn't, once the record button is, once you press stop, it's not necessarily over, you know, and everything we've done prior to this, it's always like, well, once it's down, it's down and that's it. This is really, like, it kind of begins there and it, it really is the kind of the new school of production. Yeah, there's no such thing as demoing anymore, you know, like anything that you play could end up on there, you know, regardless of how casual or like, regardless of what, you know, if it was some crappy little computer microphone or whatever that you're using, it could end yeah, up on no, there. Yeah, it was really exciting and you were off in one room, like making beats on computers. It was just such a different process for a band like us and I think we really want to continue that path. The idea is that an EP come out around August and then we play through the rest of the summer, touring with Mumford & Sons in America and Phoenix and then we, uh, we're going to take a few months off. You know, Mumford is the biggest band in America at the moment, which is crazy, isn't it? But it's fantastic. Uh, and they're kind of... A <laughs> <laughs> they are... Uh, yeah, let's leave it there. <laughs>